So, everybody, it's Do You Want a Bit of Brony here. I just off my last day of school. Finals are over. I already looked up my grades. I have passed everything. I don't have summer school. I just have the actual stuff I need to do this summer. And I am really happy right now. And I rushed home to watch ponies. Is that great? Okay. Um, I've also got some things from some of my friends in school from watching some of the videos and stuff. So... Uh, they told me these couple of things, and I'm actually going to see if I can implement that. But I'm going to need your guys' help, or anyone who bothers to comment, like my personal, my first subscriber did, it can do. Like, give me some good videos to react on on YouTube, because I do have YouTube on my, on my PS3. That's why I'm watching these episodes with Netflix and stuff. So, I'm going to see if I can do three episodes a day, so I can pace myself with the episodes... So I don't seem I'm going too fast on this, because one of the good things about being a fan of something is to have anticipation for the next episode that you're about to get. If I just one-shot the entire series, like, ten episodes a day, I'm not really going to get, like, the like the full enjoyment out of it. And I know that from, like, having to wait for a new Naruto chapter, a new Naruto episode, it's the feeling that you get when it finally is here. So maybe three, four episodes a day, probably going to stick with three. But during the day, I'm going to need to do something else, and I want to do some other content on this channel. So give me other videos to react on, like the, for some fan-made videos, because I, I want to find a fan-made videos that aren't going to spoil me, spoil me on something. Because I've seen some uh, thumbnails of certain fan animations, and they, I, I don't understand half the stuff that's going on. And... Ho hopefully I didn't, and I'm trying to get those images out of my head so I can, like, just be surprised when it actually does show up. If it does show up, unless all that is fan-made stuff, so it's, like, headcanon and whatnot. So, in the end, uh, we're watch about to watch Suited for Success, and I hope you enjoy. Yeah, I can't roll out again. Why, yes, I'm Rarity has a cat. Thank you so much for asking. <laughs> Duck face. Oh, oh, well, of course you can help me. Opal. I just have to say, these ponies give some very creative names for their pets. You got Renona for a dog name. Never heard of that before. And Opal for a cat. Angel for a bunny? It's alright. And I guess you can call Twilight uh, having Spike as a pet. Spike, a, a dragon named Spike. I'm a big fan of Spyro, so that's not really all that good of me. <laughs> A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. It's an easy feat. Magic makes it all complete. We have my... Alright, suited for success. Since this had something to do with suits, I would guess this is a rarity episode. Which is good, because I, I haven't gotten much of rarity. <laughs> Whispering is just as annoying as talking. Is there something I can help you with? <laughs> so very sorry. Try to contain worry. my rage. Could you please fix the button for me? It's my dress for the Grand Galloping Gala. <gasps> oh, no, no, no! You can't wear this. Uh, oh, say. Oh, so the gala thing is going to be like... Oh, gala. wow, so that's what they're prepping for. No problem at all. It will be my pleasure. Oh, that's really sweet of you to offer, Rarity. But I can't let you do that. It would be so much work. This dress is fine. Twilight Sparkle. I insist on making you a new dress. But, no huh. other word, I won't take no for an answer. Generosity. Well, in that case, thank you for your generosity, Rarity. Knowing your handiwork, I'm sure it will be absolutely beautiful. When you're really generous, you just can't refuse a friend. Let me guess, Applejack. <laughs> you don't want a new gown either. Oh. <laughs> Burn. I was just going to wear my old work goods. <gasps> you can't possibly be serious, Applejack. You absolutely must wear formal attire. Hmm. Nah. <laughs> 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 
that's I that habitat that for you. Just for you a little bit. No. Okay, sure. Why not? Since you're offering it off, just don't make them too uh, fruit fruity. Dear, look out below. So Rarity is like a big time designer. <laughs> Sorry, new trick. Didn't quite work. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you just it's just like asking Applejack the same question. I have to say, from the designs I've seen before, I hope they're a lot better than what what I saw in the beginning of the series. Make a different, stunning, original, amazing outfit for a one, two, three, four, five, plus yourself six ponies yes. and lickety split. Oh, <laughs> you make it sound as if it's going to be hard. I smell a song coming on. Alright, well, that was a good song. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's called Art of Dress. But I will admit, I completely noticed that the, the voice actor of Rarity has a different singing voice for Rarity. But all still good. They were pretty cool. Uh, I like them. I just need to actually see them on the actual ponies, but like. Really? I never would have guessed. I like them. Uh, but apparently not. <laughs> wow! Well, that's Blunt. She's honest about the thing. Yes, Are you sure? 
I mean, we wouldn't want to oppose. Ah, uh, this reminds me too much of something. I think it, uh, I don't know how to feel about this episode. Oh man. Long story short, me being a drawer, I had to draw some things for my friends. Let's just say they're not uh, weren't a hundred percent on how I did them. And when no one consent, they said they would still like them, but unless I like them and they like them, I have to redo them. Oh man. I love it. Oh, you're just saying that. No, no, I do. It's nice. Not nice. 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 If you don't like it, you should just tell me. Oh my god, that is exactly me. Someone just said this is nice. I need criticism, man. What is it? Will you stop asking me that? Like, just tell me what you really think. I know that. Okay. This is me in a nutshell. Do you really want to know? The on-site tank, the midi doesn't go with the shawl lapel, the hands are clearly machine stitched, the pleats are uneven, the fabric looks like twelve, you said back stitch here when it clearly calls for a toss stitch, or maybe a traditional blanket stitch, and the uber design is reminiscent of quite double tape and not true central couture. <laughs> but, uh, you know, um, whatever you want to do is fine. Now, the stars on my belt need to be technically accurate. So it's a minor one, like a very small version, and and, and the actual major one is like a billion, billion times bigger. Wait. Hold. Oh man. Wait, you're not paying for nothing. She's paying for all the fabric. See their silhouettes, and I can already tell they're horrible. I <laughs> Each of you asked for it. Now don't hold back. Let me know what you really think. <laughs> it's fine. It's cool. <laughs> they're the best duds I ever did see. It's exactly what I asked for. <sighs> Thank you, Rarity. <gasps> Are you as happy with them as we are? Well, I'm uh. happy that all of you are happy. I'm just relieved to finally be done. Yeah. You are never gonna believe it! You've heard of Hoity Toity? The big wig fashion hotshot in Cancer Lot? Oh god! Have you heard about your fashion show? Well, maybe I haven't mentioned it to him. He's coming here, all oh. the way from Cancer Lot, to see your work, Rarity! Nice one! Whoa. This is nice one, Spike. 
You could sell a ton of dresses to this guy. Your business will be booming. Yeah, wow. you know. Oh. Oh. Oh, Mikey Turkey? He's coming here? Oh. Or have all your nightmares be a reality. <laughs> oh, this is this is gonna be a, some awkward stuff, isn't it? <laughs> I think yeah, Derpy. But uh, can anyone tell me when her eyes are gonna get back so I can start calling her Derpy and it'll actually make sense? <laughs> this show has some like that pony's interesting. I can just tell by the hair. Spike has a thing for this whole announcing thing, doesn't he? Are my eyes gonna bleed? Oh, my eyes are gonna bleed, aren't they? Oh my god. I'm just as surprised. Wow. The only person I can probably stand up for is Rainbow Dash. She she kind of looks like she's ready to go into a war, <laughs> but not a fashion show. Oh, my oh those amateurs' designs look like a pile of mishmash of everything but the kitchen sink. <laughs> 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 Did they really have to see what it is? Those outfits are the ugliest things I've ever seen. Oh, for shame. Who is responsible for subjecting our eyes to these horrors? Those are just wasting my valuable time. Oh, obviously. Uh, I am a very important person. You worked really hard for this. Yes! Alright! Oh, shut up, Spike. Shut up this time. <laughs> Okay, I can clearly see where her moral is on this one, and wow. I don't care what other people say. I'm standing by my word. And I'm happy that other people have the same theory that they got the wrong element because this is just, just like they continue to hammer it in. Who knows? Maybe in season two they start to act more of their element. Now what do we do? Panic? That's your answer for everything. Well, we can't just leave. Hey, sometimes it works. You become a crazy cat lady. She only has one cat. Time. I think he has a point. <laughs> I thought we'd never become a dog person. We already have like five of them now. I guess technically I have to move away. Where would I go? I love what I pack. Oh, it's going to take me forever to do all of that packing. You're supposed to pack when you go into that pack. Packing one. Oh, whoa! Cats always do that. They always do that. Oh. I call. I call BS. Okay, I know they're friends and whatnot, but you're telling me. Again. Seriously, 
Five, all five of them had horrible ideas and stuff, so whatever. They're probably just keeping Rarity in mind. And I call it that, too. That was too good to not like. It's exactly the way I imagined it. We just followed your brilliant design. Like we should have let you do for our outfits. Alright. Those first dresses you designed were perfect. Yeah. We're so super sorry. You worked really hard to make our dresses exactly the way we wanted them. And we all saw how well that turned out. Oh, I forgive you. Well, that's my baby. But my whole career is still growing. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, you can't actually unclog uh already clogged sink, can you? <laughs> Take two. I love the little intros, that's really creative. Now I want an apple. I don't know what Pinky was, uh, was thinking. That's perfect on her. Oh, like I said, these intros, they sell it. <laughs> Rainbow, Rainbow Dash is looking like a Greek god here. <laughs> to watch this episode. Look Wait, they already did. They might even take their own advice. <laughs> Rarity, my congratulations to you on the most impressive dress in the video. Would you do me the great honor of allowing me to feature your foot duo in my best of the best boutique and catalog? Now, I'll need you to make a dozen of each dress for me by next Tuesday. Oh, Jesus. was that episode now I'm going I actually have a pretty good like review for this one I it relates to me a lot um as I said before with my drawing my friends some well at least some of them ask me like draw something for them either it be them or like a character and when I do that some sometimes they are like really genuine and saying it's good but sometimes I don't even think it's good because I try to appeal to them because I have them in in mind but if they're even the slightest bit hesitant to say how they feel about my artwork, I just suddenly feel like I failed. And so I need to redo it. No matter how many times they say, no, it's fine, I'll keep it. It's just, no, no, no. I'm doing this for you, and I need to make sure it's great. So maybe throughout the whole entire main six, Rarity is, is the one that relates to me. So I, if I had an element of harmony, it would be generosity. I have been very generous in my time with Ledge, so, yeah. 
Rarity is not my favorite pony still, even though after that big character development, having having seen more of her creative design, creative de design, creative mind with the designs that she makes, she she's obviously like a, a creative person. Unlike her friends who aren't that creative. They they just wanted to wear what they thought would look good on him, but unlike Rarity with the actual artistic vision, can clearly see that it wasn't good. They, she did, would not want them walking around in public like that. So, yeah, this episode here is ra rather great for the relativity to me and probably a lot of other people, a lot of other drawers, a lot of other people who actually do designs. Anyone who's creative and has to do something for their friends... Because I think we all have one of those moments where we where we don't feel up to it, or your friends just didn't feel up to the skills that you had. So, okay, yeah, good up, good episode, good episode. It's a very good episode. Uh, and I'm thinking about taking an hour break before starting the next one. So don't quote me on that. I probably won't because this is actually really really good. Uh, I want to actually get to the show because I really have nothing else better to do today besides sit around and watching YouTube videos, Markiplier, PewDiePie, and all that whatnot. So we'll we'll see if it comes up early. I'm sorry, if it comes up early, I I don't want to feel like I'm rushing through this. So yeah. And if you ever had to make a drinking game out of this, just just go grab a drink and take a drink every time I say so. Okay. <laughs> anyway. Bye-bye, guys.